Tudor. It's time for the summer update from the beach. What do you mean from the beach? We're hard at work on new features. How about a weekend barbecue update instead? A weekend barbecue at the beach? Hi folks, and welcome to the Mail Trap Summer Update, Weekend Barbecue Edition. We also have vegan options. We've grilled some juicy new features and seasoned them to perfection to make your Mail Trap experience equally tasty across development, delivery, and reporting. Feeling the heat? Let's cool off with a quick look at what's new. On the dev side of things, we've rolled up our sleeves and added a bunch of new API endpoints, including contact batch import and update, suppression management, contact lists, contact fields, and even domain deletion. Of course, to support all of that, we've made updates to our Node.js and PHP SDKs, making it easier than ever to integrate the new functionality into your existing setup. And for quick access to everything you need, we've also launched a brand new integrations page where you can find MailTrap SDKs, supported platforms and tools, all in one place. But before you go check that out, a quick reminder to click subscribe and hit the bell icon so you never miss new videos or updates on MailTrap features. To make workflows simpler right inside MailTrap, we've introduced automations, a feature that lets you create event-based workflows to handle routine tasks automatically without switching tools or writing custom scripts. With the current alpha version, you can use automations to trigger workflows based on contact creation, and you can build flows using blocks such as send email or time delay. New triggers and blocks, they're already in the works, including field updates, list changes, incoming API events, and more. So you won't have to wait long if you're feeling hungry for the expanded functionality and deeper logic. Visibility-wise, MailTrap Campaigns now includes reports for a clear visual overview of how your marketing emails are performing. These reports cover everything from delivery and open rates to click stats, recipient level activity, and mailbox provider breakdowns. Beyond the big features, New pricing is live, including annual billing for the Sandbox plan. And while we're on the topic of subscription plans, we've also increased the monthly sending limit on the free plan from 1,000 to 3,500 emails. The daily cap has been adjusted to 150 emails with no action needed on your part, as the new limits are already live. And to finish things off, for those of you looking to standardize features across teams and workspaces within your organization, we've fired up the grill for organizations and sub-accounts as well. So, if that sounds like something you need, stay tuned as this sizzling update is nearly ready. And that wraps up our sunny summer update. While you're soaking up the season, we'll be hard at work on the next round of improvements. In the meantime, if you'd like to learn more about any of the features we've covered, be sure to check out our how-to guides and product docs. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.